Today at Skateway, I'm going to be talking about Hammond and Leslie connector kits or console kits. These are basically mechanical kits, electronic kits that allow you to use an organ like this with a Leslie like this. Not all organs have the same type of output and not all Leslie's have the same type of input. And this can make it difficult to make the two work together. Now the first question a lot of people ask when they get a Leslie and they're new to it or a Hammond and they're new to it is how do I make them work together? And it's not always as simple as just plugging the two together. Um, there, there, you might need a console kit like I did. So in order to make my Hammond work with my specific Leslie, I needed a console kit. If you go to Tone Wheel General, you can buy different connector kits, different console kits. Trek 2 is a, a company that makes kits, but you can also buy uh, different kits made by other companies. You can shop around and find the best option for you. I would recommend calling Tone Wheel General. They are very helpful. I called them and they told me exactly which kit I needed in order to make these two work together. And they gave me a brief description on how it is set up. Now there's a couple different parts. We have the console kit, which I'll show you in just a second, that is on the back of the organ, connected. And then I have two switches here, two half moon switches. You can also find those on ToneWheelGeneral.com. And you're going to need those to switch between the different speeds. We'll look at those in just a second. If you have any questions about the different types of Leslie inputs or Hammond outputs, you should check out Captain Foldback. I'll link that in the description as well. Let's take a look at these half moon switches and then we'll look at the back at the console kit itself. Okay, so here are my half moon switches that I was just talking about. I had these professionally installed. Each one of these has a cable attached to the back of it and it is fed underneath my keyboard here and connected down below to the back of the organ where it needs to be. Now, this left half moon switch controls the different outputs. I can select all the way to the left my main speakers because this particular organ, the Hammond A100, has built-in speakers. So if I have it all the way to the left, now I am just hearing the organ speakers. I can put it in the middle. It says ensemble. That is both the Leslie and the main speakers. And then all the way to the right is just the Leslie. So I can choose between speakers on the Hammond, both, or just Leslie. This one over here controls the speed of the Leslie. You'll see that this is a three-way switch, which is kind of overkill because my Leslie is, has only two speeds, slow and fast, or corral and um, tremolo. Some Leslie models have an off and it actually stops the rotating uh, drum or horn and you have an off position. So slow, off, and fast. Let's look at the kit on the back. This is the back of my organ and this is the console kit that I had installed. Now I had a professional install this so I can't really give you a great description on how to install this but I'm sure if you called a repair shop or Tone Wheel General they could give you an idea of how to do it yourself. This is where my Leslie cable, the cable that goes between the organ and the Leslie, it plugs in right there, that's my main output. These two brown cables here, this one and this one, those go to my half moon switches that are wired underneath the keyboard and this is a plug that was installed um, it goes to the output um, of my organ alright so we just checked out the half moon switches and we checked out the console kit on the back as you can see it's not very big it's basically just an, it's basically just an interface or a middleman between the organ and the Leslie that allows them to communicate because like I said before not all Leslie's have the same inputs and not all Hammonds or organs have the same outputs. A good starting point would be CaptainFoldback.com. If you just picked up a Leslie and you're not even sure what model it is 
you should check that out. I'll put some other links in the description for uh, Leslie and organ information, but that's a good starting point. Figure out what is your input needs and what are your output needs. Start there, and then I would recommend calling someone like Tone Wheel General or a, um, an organ repair shop, someone who's a professional that you can ask some information. Hey, will this Leslie work with this organ? Is there a connector kit? for these two. The other question I get a lot is how can I play guitar through my Leslie or synthesizer? And there are preamps out there and kits that will allow you to use any quarter inch output instrument with the Leslie. Leslie themselves made the combo preamps but there are other options out there. I'm going to do a separate video about that but again your starting point should be what are my inputs? Does my combo preamp even work with the specific type of Leslie that I have? Again, not all Leslie's and organs are the same. Different outputs, different inputs, and you really need to start there. If anybody has any questions, please feel free to leave them in the comments. I will answer, answer them to the best of my abilities. Again, I'm not an expert on this, but I have learned a lot through my own uh, journey here using organs with Leslie's, guitars with Leslie's, and I've learned a lot from other experts and other professionals. Please like and subscribe if this has been helpful to you.